What's up everybody, it's your least favorite YouTuber here and today I'm going to be a little bit more emotional because I just sound like I'm very sad and depressed in the other videos but in reality I'm not. So today I have some ACR classes right here from the original CODs, Modern Warfare 2, Modern Warfare 3, yes those are original now, I, at least I'd say. So this gun not only does it feel like it, it kind of looks like it actually too with the FMJ attached to the KN44. I don't know why they changed it, changed it from the ARC. I like the ARC name better in the beta. And I know this since the beta, the attachments changed the look of it, which is pretty cool. So we have the paint job veteran, which would kind of make sense considering it's from an original COD uh, years ago. Amazing one. And it kind of looks like it, as you can see. So we have the reflex sight because the iron sight doesn't really look like it. And, you know, people usually rock the iron sight. Not the iron sight, the red dot sight on it. We have high caliber to make it look like it. We have FMJ, which is basically the key to make it look like it. We have rapid fire to make it shoot faster like it. And we have long barrel to make it just be amazing. And we have grip because this thing's not accurate at all without grip. So, you know, that ACR V2, I don't know why. I didn't call it version 3 because technically this is the third version because it was in two Call of Duty games, but I don't know. I don't think I'm going to change it. I think I'm going to have it like the original. So anyways, um, everyone uses this gun in the original Call of Duties, but this gun is pretty amazing. In this game, it's pretty awesome too, but I don't know if it's very good for long ranges because it's not really that easy to control. Now, you can add your own attachments that you want. I am just want it to be like it. Now, if you just want it to look like the ACR so you can add your own attachments, all you need is FMJ and high caliber. Other than that, bam, you're done. Because as you can see, FMJ makes the barrel look just... I don't know, it just makes it look boxy and pretty insane. Pretty insane. Looks like a tank. So, right here... Um, I don't know what happens right here, but... This is the KN44. Now this gun's pretty awesome. Um, I, I think I said that already. I have no idea what I'm saying. I don't have a script, so I'm making this all up. I have Juggernaut Control Freaks on my Xbox One. I mean Xbox, yeah, Xbox One controller. I don't know what I'm saying, but they're pretty, pretty rad. Now they're really helpful for me because I don't really like those little indents on the toggle sticks and if if my fingers are too low for a certain amount of time they kind of hurt but if these things rising my thumbs it makes me be able to play more now i'm not sponsored by control freaks if i was oh my gosh i wish i was sponsored by something i want to say what's up everybody it's your least favorite youtuber here and today if you put in my discount code you can get 10 percent i want to say that but i can't because i'm not sponsored and i probably never will be but we can't be that negative or else you'll never make it in life so anyways right here i have reject it's kind of useless i didn't really get to talk yesterday because people was in my house and um reject is kind of dumb i mean it was okay if you kept your score streaks but the only main reason why i wanted to use it was so it wouldn't count as death so you can have your kd be higher which is actually very useful um i don't care about keeping your score point things for your score streaks i just want it to not count as a death kind of like when you're getting revived in battle f battlefield yeah i haven't said that in even a long time battlefield 4 did right i don't know why everyone hates it i love that game but um anyways i do some beasts i get everything basically at the end of the game so you know that's it i'll post more videos if you want me to and uh thank you good night